What's up guys so out here at cold beer ranch and uh so this video is sponsored i got a uh, kind of partnered with uh, ecoflow um i'll open up the uh, package here in just a second give you guys uh the lowdown on on what i got i'm really excited about this so uh y'all stay tuned just a second let me get out my knife and i'll uh open this bad boy up do a little review so stand by So right now I'm unboxing the solar panels that come with the EcoFlow River Pro. And these panels are 160 watts. This carrying case is, is pretty stout, pretty substantial. The uh, solar panels are really thin. Felt like they're uh, pr pretty sturdy lightweight comes with the mc4 connectors that's me posing with this awesome eco flow river pro it boxed really well all the packaging is really nice it's super light you can see me holding it there Real clean look. It's where you plug in your connections, whether you're coming in uh, via solar or AC or DC. It's the front panel and then there's the AC. And then you can daisy chain it together there with that uh, extended port. It's got three AC outlets. Pretty nice package. Light. So here's a close up of the front panel. As you can see, it's got some uh, USB ports, regular USB ports. It's also got a uh, fast charge USB-A output port. It's got the LCD screen there. You can see it's got the DC output. It's got this handy flashlight there. It's got a low setting, a high setting, and then really cool, it's got this uh, distress SOS setting could come in handy if you're ever out there and you need it. Really clean looking unit. On the side here, it's got these, uh, you know, little flip up plastic latch that uh, I'm fixing to show you the cord. It's where you can attach the uh, extreme charging in port and uh, plug it into your house, you know, and. This thing charges up to 80% in an hour. It's pretty fast. Super, super fast charge rate. So here is the uh, solar charge or car charge input port. I'm opening up the uh, car charger. It just plugs right in and then you can plug that thing right into your cigarette lighter inside your vehicle. So I'll show you right now. Again, it's really light, easy to use. Another way to charge it up is just plug it right into your vehicle. Again, it's got a super fast recharge rate. It'll go from zero to 80% in one hour. So that's uh, really, really cool. Again, this is the EcoFlow River Pro. 
So here I'm gonna set it out and uh, pull the solar panels out and show you how that gets hooked up. Really surprised at how thin these solar panels are. Again, it's got the uh, normal, you're probably used to seeing the MC4 connectors that come with the solar panels. So this just plugs right up to your solar panels and the other end plugs right in just, just like it did on the uh, car port. It plugs into the same port there. So as you can see, these things just fold out real easy. They're very thin. It's 160 watts. You just take those MC4 connectors, plug it up to the adapter there. Put that thing out in the sun and you can recharge. EcoFlow River Pro. You can see right there, it's already, it's, it's really kind of in a sh sh shaded place and it's still, uh, looks like it was already starting to charge up pretty good. There's a little adapter and all that fits in the carrying case really nice. Look how thin that thing is. It's a 160 watt solar panel. You can go check out ecoflow.com if you want to learn more. Let me show you how portable these things are. You just run out into the woods and do what you got to do. So I was going to jump in the side by side and run out into the woods and see what kind of things I could plug up to the EcoFlow. But guess what? The battery was dead on the side by side. So I thought, hey, why not hook up the battery charger and plug it into the EcoFlow? See if that thing can charge my side-by-side -side battery and get me on the road. So I had this little car charger, battery charger here. Just turning the EcoFlow on, plugging that thing in in one of the AC ports. And you'll see this thing come on and you'll notice uh, it's got a really low battery. Literally started at 0%. So I let that thing sit there for about 20 minutes. Went outside and enjoyed some of the great weather. Came back. Things well over 95%. Sparked it right up. So I was going to go out to the cabin, do some demonstrations with the uh, EcoFlow, and the side-by-side -side was dead. And you saw it here, it took about 20 minutes, I plugged the charger in, plugged it up to the EcoFlow, and here we are, started and ready to roll. So that's awesome to know that I can have this in the back of the side-by-side, -side, and if uh, the battery goes dead, which it's been doing because of this cold weather, I can uh, charge it back up. So super stoked about that, man, this thing's awesome. So now we're out at the tiny cabin, you know, which is out in the middle of the woods and I don't have power out there. So this thing will come in real handy. They tout that you can charge up to 10 devices simultaneously because it's got multiple outlets, you know, with the three AC outlets and the car, uh, a cigarette lighter outlet and all the USB ports. So I thought, man, I'm going to load this thing up. I brought my uh, 
cordless tools out there, so I need to charge those batteries, so we plug that thing in. And I'll go ahead and put some other loads on it here in just a minute. Plug in my phone. Also have this wireless internet connection that I brought out there to the tiny cabin to see if I could get internet out there. So I'm gonna plug that thing up to the uh, EcoFlow River Pro and see if it uh, won't allow me to have internet out at the tiny cabin. As you can see, it comes on, gives me the green lights and you'll see all the bars pop up here in just a second. We got internet out at the tiny cabin. That EcoFlow is awesome. So this thing offers up to about 720 watt hour power, you know, which makes it really portable power source, especially when you're out in the woods and you don't have power. You can also daisy chain this thing with that other connection and uh, add another EcoFlow to it and, you know, get about 1440 watt hours. So it's a little warm out there, so I'm gonna go ahead and plug in a fan. Just loading this bad boy up. No problem for the EcoFlow. Really like the way this thing looks and the way that it works. It's a great portable power solution. Check out more information in the description down below.